In this video, we're going to have a look at how to use a multimeter to measure voltage. So this is an auto ranging multimeter and it's turned off at the moment, but if we turn it to the voltage selection option, we'll be able to start measuring voltage. You can see by default, it's set to measuring DC. If you press this mode button, it will change to measuring AC. So we've set it to measuring DC and I've got some voltage here coming in on this voltage rail. These are the test probes that came with the multimeter. And I don't know if you can see that, but that's a banana plug inside there. You need to plug these into your multimeter to use it. So you wanna plug the black plug into the common and you wanna plug the red plug into this terminal here. See the voltage symbol? We're measuring voltage. This voltage symbol here is telling us it can measure AC or DC. This is the symbol for DC. This is the symbol for AC. So you can see here, there is the symbol for DC and the symbol for AC, telling us that it can measure DC or AC. Here I am plugging in the red cable into the common. Here I am plugging in the black cable into the voltage. And we can see we've got negative 12, ah uh, no, I've got the red probe on the black cable and the black probe on the positive. <clears throat> so here we have 12 volts on our input. It's difficult to hold the component or the board and the probes. I don't know about you, but I've only got two hands and it's hard to grow a third when you need one. Now the probes that I really like using are probes like this. These probes have a little clip on the end. I call these clips alligator clips. So you can use the alligator clips to grab the exposed wire. There it is, hands free. Same as before, you need to plug your probes in. So here we've got a black wire going down our ground power rail. And look, we've got the red wire on the end. Here we are measuring 12 volts. Now this is another type of test probe. These are called parrot clips. Same deal as before, black and red. But if you see here, it's got a little push button. So if I push that down, you can see there's a little extendy bit. Put the component at the end and it'll hook onto the component. Parrot clips are really good for hooking onto the end of a through hole component. If you look really closely, they've got a little wedge on the end. So this way you can use them like a probe as well. Same as before, plug your probes into the appropriate hole, hook one, the other, voila! Measuring the voltage on our power rail. And that's it. Now you know how to measure voltage on stuff.